The transport team was delayed in picking Miss Jillian up from her hotel, and my team has told me that she is extremely agitated. I want to have a clearing conversation with her so that we will not have any upset present during the healing process. Morning, sunshine. Good morning. How are you? Oh, I'm well. <laughs> is that true? Is that true for you? But I asked the question. Is that true? I asked a question as well. No, but I asked you first. Oh, fine. Is that true? Yeah. Mm. I wanted to, before we start our work today, just have a quick conversation about how unprofessional you guys are for making me sit there for two hours. Now, why is that unprofessional for you? I didn't get an update, anything. Don't tell me to check out of my hotel room at 9 and then sit there till 11.30 with nobody telling me, updating me, somebody's coming. I could have stayed in the room. But see, the thing that I wanted to talk to you about was that right there. What are you talking about? I'm fabulous, my voice. That you don't have to. I'm taking you on a calm to. nature. No, you're not. That's yes, why I am. I'm talking to you what, like you're talking to me. I'm telling you how I'm experiencing it. Okay. And if you do it to me, who you don't know, if you do it to me, who you came for for help, how you, you do it to sure... me for you don't know. You don't sit your guests who you're trying to supposedly help in a lobby for two hours without updating them. That's rude. You're Here's trying to stir way. up drama by making me sit at this hotel. You think I'm a fool? What I know how TV work. You're going to have me sit here so I can get riled up because this is for your no, rating on this show. No, it isn't. OK, ma'am. Let me tell you what happened today. Because I don't feel healed. How about that? Well, how about we haven't done the work? We can't how get to the work can't get to the work until you are being a professional. Until you get ready to release that energy. I could have come out here and continue to move on, but my concern for you to be able to do this work is that I wanted to clear that energy. So you've made up what this was about. I've been working with Ramon. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. This is what you're taking into the marriage. And this is what he has to deal with. I'm not taking and this into the marriage. are you aware that this is like the this, level of stress? It doesn't me. matter whether or not you talk to him. It's in your energy. You're bringing it in the room with you. You don't have to ever open your mouth. You sleep in the bed with that. And if you would do it to me, and I'm here committed to your are intention. Are you committed? Absolutely. Absolutely committed. Okay. But what I'm not going to be is abused I'm and disrespected. I you touched are, you. and you're probably not aware. You're probably you. not aware of how you. nasty calm. your energy is. You are not. You're yelling at you're me. Not. I'm calm. What I'm saying to you is you are not aware no. of the level of toxicity in oh, your energy. My toxic and energy. And that's what okay. I wanted to deal with you with before we go in to do the work. Okay. So that you don't bring that to Ramon. Okay. And I won't bring it I to Ramon. I haven't given you permission to speak to me in that way. I haven't I given you elder. permission to disrespect me like that. I have this. not disrespected you. With this, your unprofessionalism. I want to know, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to cut this right now. Let's do it. Get me Mr. Ramon. Anger is a common response to feelings of powerlessness. Miss Jillian's anger is not only about her having to wait in a hotel lobby, it is also about her inability to relinquish control and surrender to this healing process. So what happened was there was some breakdown this morning between Miss Jillian and production. And production called her. They did give her the instruction to come down, and they weren't there at that time. Why? Then when they, why? Yeah. Because of just technical things going on. We have to set up what we're doing today. We have that to be ready. That has nothing to do with your driver. It wasn't her safety supposed to be her priority, though? Excuse me? Her safety is your priority. It wasn't her safety. She was in the hotel. She was, she in, was the in the lobby, lobby of the hotel. Right. So what? Anything uh, can happen in the lobby. I mean, know, she was in the room to herself. I can only tell you what happened. I can only tell you what happened. I wasn't even aware that it happened because my schedule says that I'm going to meet with Look, you I, first. My thing is that I trusted with you guys when, and love by putting her in a different hotel last night in the first place. I didn't want that to happen. I didn't want us to be separated in the first place. One of the things that you emphasized with me was protecting her. And I was being with her and making sure that she's safe. What makes her. you think that she was unsafe? She had, doesn't have, let me first tell you. First of all, when y'all dropped her off last night, y'all dropped her off 30, 34, 35 minutes away from me, something like that, 40 minutes away from me. She's in what the hotel What does that have herself. to do with she what we're talking about right now? She's it a grown woman. Yeah, she is a grown but woman. But we're but. not talking about her safety. Her complaint was not about safety. 
Well, That's wait. not what her comment was well, to me. She's still, her, her comment to you right now is that you guys stays her to get a reaction out of her. But That's that is not saying. true. That's not true. And because you think that, I'm done. Okay. I told you yesterday, this is my ministry. This is not what I do. I just happen to do it on television. Well, if we're done, we're done. I just, we're done. Because without trust, we have absolutely nothing. And I don't nothing. trust you. There we go. I'm done. We don't have to do Somebody this Somebody take me home, please. Go get your stuff. Oh, my stuff is already ready, man. No problem. Bye, y'all. For Miss Jillian and Mr. Ray, their inability to trust in the healing process reveals a much larger issue. Despite the fact that they reached out for help, there is a level of awareness about themselves and their relationship that they are unwilling to step into. And so, our time together has ended prematurely.